Well, I'm over in the uh, northwest corner of our 15, and uh, we just there's a the trees here got uh, black locusts and elms up over them, and you can see right there center frame. There's a nice little swamp chestnut oak, but he's only about three inches diameter. Got choked out by these others. Anyway, we're cutting them loose, getting rid of things around them. And one of the things we got here is a big old nasty honey locust. I got rid of one honey locust over there. You can see a stump there in a tree land. Got rid of a honey locust there. And boy, this thing's a chunk. It's about a 16 inch diameter tree. Thorny as can be. Look at these thorns. When it goes over, I'm afraid I'm going to get stabbed by thorns on these branches hanging behind. I hope I can duck through there. And uh, this, of course, it's got weight. The weight's back that way. And I want to finish up there. I don't want this thing falling back there. I'm throwing these trees where I've been working, you know, throwing them back into holes I've already made. So, got all four wedges here. Let's see if we can get her to go. drive these these orange ones in it it'll keep my, my two tones from getting to the hinge I don't want to get the hinge because then I gotta figure out a new way to go here I move one okay now here are two tones again See, got a pretty good lift on her already. Open that up over an inch. Getting hard. Not quite to the hinge yet. We can drive these a little farther. Getting that opened up pretty good on the back side. She's moving a little. Whew. Let me see how she looks up looking up here. Yeah, I've got a big limb hanging back. It's throwing her balance back. If it was a straight tree, it'd go now.
Okay, we're gonna scoot that one in right there. Oh, I'm caught. My shirt's caught. There, there we go. Stand back and look, I hear it moving. Is it going? Oh, it ought to be going. It's tipping pretty good. Yeah, we got her opened up good. I think this one is loose. Now. Yeah, see that one's loose. That's all the way in. did that one was loose pulled out her thicker hinge or these two tones are thicker right on there give a little bit more go oops my axe just popped oh gone my uh, wedge just popped out of my axe from. Well, no more pounding with that, and I don't have another beaten iron in the truck. That's my only beaten iron. Well, son of a gun. That is over center, I know. I hear it moving up top. Head fell off. Crumb. Okay, she's moving. Let's get back and see if it'll go. Yeah, that's tipping pretty good. Well, if I come back tomorrow, that thing will be on the ground. I'd sure like for it to fall today while we're watching it. I heard a limb shift up above. There she's going. She's going right now. Oh, yes. That was wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, they get tangled up with every little limb above them, and they don't want to let go. Anyway, got her on the ground. I got out from under that thing before the thorns could grab me. Okay, wonderful. And I'm going to get home and patch up my little beaten iron. And let me 
pull my glove off here we can take a look well you look how fast these weed trees grow look at those growth rings on that thing they're three-eighths or better some of those rings are almost half an inch they grow like a weed and these things are a weed they're a, nat they're a native tree but boy they're they're no fun Okay, enough of that one. Got it on the ground. Got an excuse to quit for the day. Don't have a way to drive a wedge, so that's good. Okay, thank you all for watching. We'll catch you all later. Time to quit.